bother him. I think that one's all. And another one fall. And that score puts him even. A night I never thought we'd see. He's now tied point for point with the record. One more score. He'll be all alone at the top of the record books. GA, a moment nobody thought they'd ever see. And people have talked about records that could never be matched. Will Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan, and David Aldridge will be joining us on the sideline as well. Couple terrific centers in tonight's matchup here. Great, here great pivots, but uh, center matchups are far from traditional, it seems like, these days. No doubt about it, Kevin. Once you get into this now small ball mindset, this positionless game, I mean, you're seeing guys as short as P.J. Tucker play the five because, listen, when you're 25 feet from the basket, if I'm 6'2 and you're 7'2, I can still guard you. So because of the spacing now, it allows you the luxury to play smaller. Now let's take a look at Honolulu's opening lineup. We've got Williams. Colts is out there with Oladipo. Then it's the kid, and it's Gallinari in at the four-man position. Well, Oladipo playing a couple years at point guard in Orlando when he started his career, showing off his passing ability there. Now here is Irving. Gay outside. Pass to Winslow. Over Williams. That one a little long. And here's Honolulu. Four-point game. The kid. Yep, that one goes. The kid's got six. Uncovered at the rim, finding cracks in the defense here early on. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. And guys, if you let Aldridge get inside with the ball, you've already lost. I mean, it's too big, too strong, too skilled. Greg, LaMarcus Aldridge taking more three-pointers last season, easily passing his career high as an attempt with almost three a game. And Aldridge shot a very respectable percentage from outside. In order to play heavy minutes at the four, you need to be able to shoot. Good to see Aldridge still adding new wrinkles to his game. Bangs home the trifecta. And that's now nine points for the kid. Great start for him. 4-4. Four, four. He could be in for a big game. Here's Sexton. Got a piece of it. the kid and he takes that one up and powers it through and running with a full head of steam but completely under control yeah, you think he's comfortable at that speed he's done it so many times before just an absolute blur in transition and that helps get the rhythm going now here's gay basket counts well, the balance that rudy gay has outstanding job at staying in control even when getting hit Here's the kid, and again, it's Honolulu from deep. Guys, he can't miss, I swear. He was trying to miss that. He did not miss. That means he can't miss. Yeah, another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively here so far. Here's the kid. He's got 14. And again, it's Honolulu from deep. He doesn't look satisfied with the lead right now. He wants more. And he looks like he's going to get it. And first time out of the game called for Phoenix. You got to like what the kid has done in this game. And he's just attacking the rim with force here. They need to try and deny him the ball in the paint to keep him away from the basket. And here in the first, uh, about three minutes in. Fultz against Irving. And yes, it's good. I don't know how he does it, but Kyrie does such a great job to get deep position and convert, separating himself from other point guards in the league with that finishing ability. Here's the kid. He's got 17. Let's it go from deep. And again, it's Honolulu from deep. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five makes are from beyond the arc. Now 
foul. Here's Irving. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. It's on Markel Fultz. Not much of a surprise there. Kyrie is one of the better free throw shooters in the game and so hard to guard without fouling. So for the Suns, Ray Lyles comes in for Rudy Gay. And it's Powell in for Justice Winslow. Honolulu also making some changes. Howard's checked in for Williams. Reddick comes in for Victor Oladipo. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Fultz. Suns trail by 10. And here's Sexton. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Powell finds Aldridge. Misses the jumper. His touch from mid-range, and that's almost always good. That won't shake his confidence. From outside the arc, good. He's now got 10 of 10 from the field. And when you got someone putting on a show like this, I mean, in the first quarter, you have got to be kidding. Irving passes to Aldridge. That's tipped. Outside Irving. Five on the clock. Aldridge against Reddick. And it's Aldridge missing. Yeah, one player sometimes can drag down your offense, and he seems to be an anchor here in this quarter. And that one drops for him. 27 points for the kid. This is as good as it gets for a first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. Irving surveying the floor. And they get it. And he's good on the three ball. Irving's got seven. Trying to find that consistency from distance that's stretching out the defense. And that's why Kyrie always has an available driving lane. So Honolulu calls timeout. They're first. Craig in New York, you obviously played in a number of championship contending teams. What did the Knicks have to do to get back to that field, that kind of team? Well, listen, it starts with stability across the board, but mainly that means at the top. And you got to give this new front office, this new regime, an opportunity. I think they got some good young pieces. Uh, but title contenders are not in a constant state of flux right now. They've got to take their baby steps here and start moving in the right direction. Like you say, it does begin in the front office. Here's Brunson following the basket by Kyrie Irving. Redick with the bucket. Yeah, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three-point range. There's the pass to Irving. Goes to the reverse layup and packs it in. 11 points in the game. Strong start here early. Four of his first five made. Here's Marjanovic. Howard trying to free himself up. And that one's good. Marjanovic. The assist totals, Kevin, just continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. Now, here is Irving. 11 points in the game. Inside, Giant. And he comes up with the deuce. Yeah, put some students in the classroom because that's exactly how you move. the ball Kyrie terrific at spotting the open man and then you got to get it to him pass to Marjanovic outside Redick shot clock reset for Honolulu Clark inside guarded by Porter and that one's good by Clark defensively giving up far too many open Rhythm look. Jones checked in for Trey Lyon. And Honolulu with the change here, too. The kid he's checked in for Dwight Howard. I'm glad we got to see the mobile one block once more. What a play. The, the defensive awareness, the timing, when you have to face a defender that can reject you like that, it can alter your approach. And the basket is good. Irving's got 13. Feels like the other four guys have disappeared at this point. He wants to be the one to get them back. Connects from three-point range. 30 points for the kid. Yeah, they built up this lead three points at a time. Well, a lot of importance placed on outside shooting. And tonight you can see why after that kind of quarter exploding from the perimeter. 
displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Yeah, if you walked in at any point during this game to watch five minutes of play, one team played harder. We know who that was. And as we conclude the first quarter, a one-sided... to have you with us folks second quarter of basketball this game has not exactly been neck and neck but plenty of time left in this one and guys uh, for Honolulu what jumps out to you stat one Well, the coaches preach ball movement, and, and we saw exactly why in that first quarter. Well, everybody just feeling the energy of the basketball as they moved it around, and lots of hands were touching it. On the court for Honolulu, they've got Marjanovic. Clark is out there with Williams. Then there's J.J. Redick, and it's Fultz in at the point. Fultz is not just looking to score the ball. He also is equally engaged in terms of facilitating for his teammates. The kid he's checked in for Marjanovic. And it's Irving with the ball for Phoenix. Trailing by 17. Passes it to Porter. There's the dish to Powell. Here's Irving. Solid play in the low block and that one's good. 17 points in the game. Kyrie has so many layers to what he can do to you offensively. Loves pulling out the soft, delicate floater. Took him no time at all on that one. And now that's 35 points for the kid. Irving up top, guarded by Fultz. And so it's going to be a three-second violation out there on the defense. The Suns have been perfect at the line so far, albeit just two for two. And so he hits the technical free throw. Rudy Gay's checked in for Phoenix. Winslow comes in for Norman Powell. Second quarter of basketball, about one minute played so far. And there it is for him. Maybe he's thinking at this point, man, somebody's got to help me. I can't do this all by myself. Here's the kid. And the three off target. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. And that is quintessential team basketball. Winslow recognizing one of his guys was wide open. And Kevin Porter Jr., all the issues you'd expect from a rookie. Greg, unforced errors, a few too many fouls and turnovers. But as you and I were talking, and as the coaches told us, the upside is huge. I tell you, Kev, his first step with the ball in his hands is incredible. Can burst by defenders like this are waiting at a bus stop. Once he matures, he's going to be a handful to deal with. Now Porter following Rudy Gay's three-point attempt. The great talkers over the years, trash talkers on the floor in this league. Do you think they do it more to get themselves going, Greg, or do they do it with the purpose of getting under their opponent's skin? And Kevin, that's a, a great question. And believe it or not, you see both. I've seen guys who do it to get under your skin, but I've also seen guys that do it for their own benefit. That's how they derive their confidence. And so uh, it's about you figuring out what works for you. I've seen some guys, they don't say smack. They don't, they don't say a word during the course of the game, but they will cut your heart out. So it's just about what fits your personality in terms of making you play your best. Well, I'm glad you don't trash talk here on 2K, Greg. I'll tell you that right now. No, we don't do that. <laughs> and I was sure that was money on that one, but everyone is afforded an easy miss or two. Yeah, that happens. Important thing is for players, just don't beat yourself up and make a miss like that cost you another play. And it's the Suns with the ball. Following the three-point basket by Honolulu. A three ball. But they recover it. Who's back up? Back to Sexton. Traps in the tray. Well, that's in rhythm and right on target as Sexton has a very well-rounded offensive game and playing in control now. Timeout called Honolulu. And the Suns making a change here. Isles checked in. Honolulu also making some changes. Alinari, he's checked in for Clark. And it's Oladipo in for J.J. Reddick. Pass to the kid. Another shot. And he hits the jumper for two. 
The kids got 43 points. Uh, with the finish line in sight, this guy is determined to be the one to put the game away. Sexton against Oladipo. Aldridge kicks to Winslow. Lock at six. Headshot off. Now Honolulu takes it the other way. Feeds to Williams. Oh, wow! And guys, that's not as easy as he made it look. You've got to have some skills to pull that off. Well, he's got plenty of those, yes. that's for sure. Winslow dishes to Sexton. the block. Good timing from Victor there as he swipes that one away. In the corner, it's Aldridge. The basket good off the assist from Sexton. Seven points for LaMarcus Aldridge. He does so much out there to stretch out the defense when he's out on the perimeter and he drains the triple. Got that one up quick. 46 points for the kid. And I like the back and forth here showing confidence from Reigns. It seems like they're going to find out who can make the deepest threes. Right now, it's a shootout. Count that one. Toughness there shown by Colin Sexton. No stranger to having to out-muscle the defense from time to time. I love the aggressiveness. He's been on fire the entire first half and continues to strike while the iron's hot. And here are the Suns now. It's an 18-point game. The pass to Lyles. Again, Phoenix. Of all the action happening there, it's the assist that jumps out to me there. That's just a great look and a great setup for the bucket. Quick shot there, and it's off target. Williams against Gay. One fifty-eight left in the second quarter. Over Williams. And the rebound goes to Honolulu. Here's the kid. And got it. Another basket. My goodness. 50 for the game. Yep, he is putting on a show. Phoenix calls timeout. You got to like what the kid has done in this game. The defense has to take the ball out of his hands. He's just knocking down every three-pointer he takes right now. Phoenix making some changes. Harry Giles is checked in for Alden. And Norman Powell subbed in for Winslow. Honolulu also making some changes. Dwight Howard. He's checked in for the kid. Marjanovic comes in for Williams. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Fultz. Sexton kicks to Giles. It's the rim-rattling two-handed jam. What elevation. He's a smaller but still determined big man. And he likes mixing it up with his impressive vert. Pass to Howard. It's hauled in by Lyle. And that one's good, Marjanovic. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. To the inside, Sexton. Lee Baz was put in just the right spot. Sexton's got seven points for the quarter. It took a little bit of time, but now he's taking the pen off the cap and putting his mark on this game. Howard, the pass to Marjanovic. The kick out to Oladipo. Here's Brunson. Good, and it's Oladipo picking up the assist. Oladipo's got his third assist on the ninth. Broke loose. It's stolen by Marjanovic. Oladipo outside to the middle. Brunson, good. Brunson's got his second basket of the night. Not getting old here, seeing him make that lead pass with perfect timing. Passes it to Powell. And the foul on Victor Oladipo. That is his first foul of the game. Some changes for Phoenix. Damian Jones is checked in for Trey Lyles. Porter comes in for Rudy Gay. 
and Kyrie Irving subbed in for Sexton. And Honolulu with the change here, too. The kid, he's checked in for Dwight Howard. Now, here's Porter. Just five on the clock. Howell for three. Good on the three-point shot. Howell's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. That's just tremendous scoring instinct. So fun to watch him work in the half court. And Matador defense, that's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see. Yeah, feels like Christmas right now. Just gift wrapping points. And so it's Honolulu closing out the quarter with a 20-point lead. And with as many three-pointers as they've drained, it's easy to see why they're on the cusp of a blowout. Don't go. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. Checking out Honolulu. Kenny, how'd you feel about it? It's been unreal offensive performance, Ernie. They've taken this defense to task. They're finding good shots on almost every possession. I don't know that they could have executed any better on that end of the floor. Chat, what'd you think about Phoenix? Well, they're obviously facing a hot. And then. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. A fantastic game from the kid in this one. Yeah, he's been nothing short of a wall at the rim so far in this one, single-handedly providing great rim protection. Been aggressive to block shots, but also avoiding fouls. That's a, that's a heavy presence inside. Well, we've got a moment. Let's set the floor. Brought to you by Gatorade All Field Up for the second half. And Phoenix, look at who they've got on the floor. They've got Kyrie Irving. Rudy Gay is out there with LaMarcus Aldridge. And it's Justice Winslow. And it's Sexton in at the shooting guard. Irving dishes to Gay. The feed to Sexton. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Sexton's got nine. When you get physical like that, I don't think Sexton minds it all that much, able to play through it. And the Cavs really took a long look at Colin Sexton last year as a playmaker, and it seems like he's moving more and more into that role of being a microwave scorer. Here's Gay. A shot off that time. Now Honolulu takes it the other way. Here's the kid. And again, it's Honolulu from deep. And Brent, the numbers for Sexton back that up. He's a great scorer, as we know, but his assist totals are low. And this is why I think, Kevin, there's a lot of consideration where Sexton might move naturally into that guy that comes off the bench and creates disruption with his offensive output. Feels like a lot of Lou Williams type of moments could be ahead for a player like Colin Sexton. Wasted no time on that shot, but it's off the mark. Pass to Gay, and the jam by Rudy Gay. So many highlights of Rudy Gay early on, challenging defenders at the rim. Another one there on the alley-oop. Now flying high and throwing it down with the one hand. One of his favorite moves right there, guys. And the kid picks up the foul. That's foul number two for him. Clark, he's just... in for Honolulu. Reddick comes in for Oladipo. Winslow finds Irving and the whistle blows. It's going to be on Markel Fultz. That's foul number two for him. The kid he's checked in for Honolulu. Irving passes to Winslow. Irving against Fultz. The shot's good from Irving. Irving's got 22. Feels like Kyrie locked in right now. No let up in his offensive attack, and he's hot. And another one falls. Amazing. That's 62 points. 62. Amazing. A, a remarkable performance from him so far. Outside Irving. Gay trying to break free. A shot's good from Irving. 
Irving's got four this quarter. You can't just stop when there's a pick set up. Got to fight over it as a defender. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You hate to see him give up in that situation. Pass to Alder. It's a plus five advantage for them in rebounding after that one. And Winslow pulls it down. Winslow's got four rebounds now tonight. Gay with no one around. And a miss there on the triple. Honolulu leading by 22. Takes the three. Connects again from distance. And this parade of threes has no end in sight. He just keeps knocking them down. Oh, and that latest triple ties him for second for the most threes in a game. What a monster he's been from deep. And the Suns call time here. And looking back at what was a stellar career, Greg, if there was one thing you could have done different, do you have anything on your mind? You know, I, I would have loved to have had the opportunity to finish my career in New York. Uh, the, Unfortunately, that didn't transpire, but that's the one thing that, that stands out. That and obviously not winning the championship. I can understand both of them. Yes. Timeout called Honolulu. For three. Volts kicks to Reddick. Malinari outside. Honolulu passing it around. Six on the shot clock. The second chance effort. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. And the foul called on the Phoenix Suns. Honolulu shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. First free throw is good. A different look for Honolulu. Howard comes in for Williams. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Fultz. He's perfect from the line this time. The Sun squad struggling. Here's Powell. Now the pass to Giles. He dishes it to Irving. A three. They grab their own miss. And it's Giles missing. The edge on the glass is the difference. It's allowed them to build this lead. Here's the kid. Non-stop scoring. And again for three. And of course it falls for him. That three pushes him into the history book. Well, he is now tied for the most threes in a game. This is a night we will never forget. Oh, that's great TNT, baby. Uh, Explosive. That was pretty, and he just has that effortless knack for getting inside. Here's the kid. A three-pointer off the mark. And it's Irving with the ball for the Phoenix Suns. the wing Porter and the rebound goes to Honolulu the kids got his sixth rebound on the night from past the arc out of bounds it'll go to the Suns Damian Jones is checked in for Phoenix Marjanovic checked in for Honolulu Victor Oladipo comes in for Gallinari Here's the Suns with the ball. 132 left in the third quarter. Brunson against Irving. Powell for three. And the rebound goes to Howard. Ooh, he missed an easy chance to put some points on the board. He won't get a much better look at that kind of shot again here probably tonight. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice. On that possession. Trying more and more to utilize the three-pointer. It's a good idea. That's his second three of the game. One in each half. Reddick for three. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Reddick's got six. And those aren't the type of three-point opportunities that you can allow in the NBA. 
Pass to Porter. Shoots from 12. And the rebound goes to Honolulu. And with the success they've had rebounding the basketball, they're right where you'd expect them to be, firmly in the driver's seat. Now that's the kind of passing right there that makes a difference, not just in that possession, but maybe on your play for the entire game. Serving against Brunson. And there's the foul. It's on Jalen Brunson. That's his first foul. The kid he's checked in for Dwight Howard. Powell against Oladipo. And they've won the rebound battle so far, and it's translated to the scoreboard. Yeah, it's not. He got it again. Sensational. He's scoring at an insane level here, folks. The defense powerless to slow him down. Yeah, he's on a mission, closing in on third place all time in scoring. And Will Chamberlain holds both the first and third place scoring marks. First, of course, for 100 points and third place all time with 78. Anytime Wilt's name comes up, you are making history. And at the end of the third quarter, a huge lead in this one may already have been decided. as we head into the fourth we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same from the first three quarters <laughs> on the court for Honolulu Allen is out there with Garrett Temple then there's Morganovich, and it's Clark in at the four. Timeout called Honolulu. Here's the kid. Good! Another from three. And that is a three that will put him in the record book. A historic performance by a historically good shooter. One of the best games anybody has ever had. And the dunk by Jackson. Precision pass from Moutier to get his teammate a good look there. Here's the kid. Yet another bucket. He has been simply unstoppable. And he's now third all-time for points in a game. One for the ages. He surpassed Wilt Chamberlain's less famous scoring mark for 1961. And Kobe Bryant now in his sight. And the Suns call time. You got to like what the kid has done in this game. Well, they got to be used this timeout to think about a personnel change or a game plan change to try to slow him down. Outside, Porter. Outside, Green. Shot clock at six. To the paint. And it's Jones that time on the assist from Green. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. Here's the kid. And it's off from three-point range. And it's the Suns ball. Shoots it. And that one goes long. Beyond the arc. Not going to go that time. And Phoenix will come the other way. And here's the fast break. Porter leading the way. Another three for Phoenix. Textbook. Nice pass. Great catch. Even better finish. This is it to the kid. Fires the three. And good! He hits it again. And that score moves him up in the record books yet again. He now stands, Greg, alone for second place for points. What an unbelievable night. And with 81 in the rearview mirror, he only has the great Will Chamberlain and his 100 mark left. A record nobody thought would be touched. But this is the closest anybody has ever come. Releases. Oh, and that one had the right spit on it, and it is good. The kids has got 10 points in the quarter. And it's the Suns with the ball. Moutier kicks to Jackson. Good ball movement here by the Suns. Moutier finds Jackson. 
A basket good off the assist from Moutier. Moutier's got three assists now in this one. And over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. And that one, good. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Confidence is sensational, and it feels like no one is going to stop him tonight from scoring. How about the concentration? He gets hit, but stay. with the play and gets the finish. Lyles checked in for Kevin Porter. Williams, he's checked in for Honolulu. A free throw good from Moutier. And still trying to find his footing in the league. Moutier must show improvement in his shooting moving forward. Allen. Misses and he wants that one back. Four on three as they bring it up. Lyles and he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. And there's the whistle foul on Honolulu. The first free throw is good. And the Suns here with a different look. LaMarcus well, Aldridge he's checked in for Jones. Justice Winslow comes in for Jackson. Sexton he's checked in for Green. And Kyrie Irving subbed in for Emmanuel Moutier. The kid he's checked in for Honolulu. Trills the three pointer. It's been this way since halftime. Tremendous production from beyond the arc. Yeah, pretty infectious right here. Guys in good spirits and percentages from downtown on the rise in the second half. Here's the floater. Aldridge wide open. He fires and misses it off the right side of the rim. Aldridge has gone three of nine tonight from the field. 33%. Good. He hits again. That's 91. An incredible feat. This is just flat out insane. Irving drives in, nails the 16-footer. Irving's got 33. Well, he makes it look effortless out there. Until the defense actually presents a challenge for him, expect those kind of results. Oh, good with the triple. And so Sexton will bring it up for the Phoenix Sun. And Sexton slams it in. Sexton with the ball on a string with a beautiful sequence. Here's the kid from outside off the mark. Now here's Winslow down low. And there's Sexton. That's good on the assist by Winslow. The closer Sexton gets to the basket, the more dangerous he can become. And the defense has got to recognize that. Timeout called Honolulu. Giving up a run here. Can, can they turn it around? Hard to say right now. At this point, I've seen the coaches run through two or three iterations of defense. Is there a fourth? I'm not sure. And now, a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, the kid. And guys, he's been about as close to perfection as you can be. The intensity he's played with has been amazing. Just no let up. And as fired up as he's been, he's never let his emotions get out of control. Well, to come in here facing a hostile crowd and have a game like he's had, that's what separates the good players from the great players. Shoots, and he wills that one in, sinking right through off the back iron. Another good play. This is how they built the lead, calling on the right guys at the right time. Basketball IQ is something that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. There's Winslow, and the dunk by Winslow. Oh, I thought Winslow was going to rip that rim off. What a dunk. Honolulu leading by 22. Here's the kid, and it's good. Assisting on the play was Williams. Defensively, you can't afford to give him that kind of look, especially down this many points. Teachable moment there. Lapses like this are backbreakers. Inside. Here's Irving. And he banks in the lane. Irving's got 15 points here in the second half. Kyrie not backing away from the contact there. In fact, welcoming that one. Tricks you into it. And, and slams it home and gets some camera time on the end of it. He did. He, he spent a while up in that rim, didn't he? So it's Phoenix now. Irving up top. Defended by Allen. 
Irving misses. I don't think the defense does enough out there to bother him. I think that one's all. And another one falls. And that score puts him even. A night I never thought we'd see. He's now tied point for point with the record. One more score. He'll be all alone at the top of the record books. GA, a moment nobody thought they'd ever see. And people have talked about records that could never be matched. Wilt's 100 was at the top of those lists. But the unbelievable has happened here tonight as he has tied that unbreakable record. And the Suns call time here. They trail by 28. 125 left in the game. And Honolulu making a change here. Brunson's checked in. 125 left to play here in the fourth. Outside Jackson. Moody finds Jackson. Outside Jones for the three. And there's a whistle. That goes on Harry Giles. That's his third foul of the game. That's pretty much not how they want to defend the three-point line. Somebody's got to shadow him out there. The kid he's checked in for Honolulu. And here's Honolulu. Off the inbound pass. Sinks the three-pointer. Bottom line, you need shooters on your team who can space the floor. No, there's no doubt he's a legitimate threat from downtown, and he's demonstrating that in this game. Well, that's a shot they want just about on every possession, if they can get it. He doesn't make them all, but still very much a high percentage look. Looking around, pass to Giles. The putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Oh, great timing. He is one tough customer on that offensive glass. You know, it's like he has a sixth sense of where that rebound is going. Connects again. And he's been dominant here thus far. Shouldering the offense, GA really taking it to the opposition. Moutier with the ball. Yep, that one goes in there. Like the explosiveness of Moutier. They're powering through the defense on that difficult finish. Timeout called Honolulu. Guys, your thoughts? And a surprising timeout here with the game in the bag. Sometimes you want to have these teachable moments on the floor and not in the next day's film session. So coach electing to do that here. So Honolulu wins it. This one was over well before the final buzzer. The fans were waiting for something to get excited about Greg, but they never got it. They sure didn't. I mean, they just rolled to this win. They made it look really easy. What an efficient performance at both ends. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. So for David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, Brent Berry, and the whole 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us. We'll see you later. Thank you.